Hello everyone, welcome back to some of plays Monster Train. We did win the random stuff. Covenant rank 10 now, let's go. That rank 10 covenant actually makes the invasion bonus worse. What do we have here? Didn't we play with this just... I mean, not last episode, but it's it's Umbra again. I guess fine. I do like the Ice Tornado. We've won with that for sure. Again, the Sap Boss. When you summon your first morsel, draw a card. 50% chance to apply Spell Weakness. More Spell Weakness or damage spells cast this turn cost one less. The sweep spell weakness is too good, right? It's too good. The fact that it adds sweep is just amazing. I just said this is gonna be more dangerous, I'm still gonna do it. If I put them here now, he's going to be dazed. But what I can do is... I aware? Aware? Save you. You're dazed for a turn, that's fine. We'll take three damage. And now I get a train conductor to put in front of this one. I can put another train constructor in front. I guess so. play this now you will get healed but what if I do this first oh the heal still happens and this thing doesn't actually ex the extinguish doesn't have work anymore all right did I just screw it up I want this for sure yeah, we don't get the extra gold. Three, and then three, five, the next turn. I mean, it just put the damage shield. This is not... An easy fight at all. We're taking some damage everywhere. I could ice tornado here, or I do it like this, and we will take six damage. But I can help out with this. Oh my goodness! It actually hit him four times. That's insane. You're just gonna die. Great ice tornado there. Five damage and frostbite on the offering. Spell weakness to one enemy unit. And then ice tornado, that doesn't seem right. I think we take the offering and hope that we get some draw discard shenanigans. I took that, try to upgrade, like, three rare morsels is kind of nice, I want the, ooh, but that's a unit upgrade, I mean a, a free unit. This one is spell upgrade, we could find, reduce cost holdover, that's still not good enough, I guess. We need the extra unit, I think, it's too good early on. 
in card sap? Or do I want something to block for my dude? I like in the Incan Sap, we just unlock that one. Make a unit quick, no. <laughs> Damage shield 2 seems good though. I can give the trains to a multi strike. And plus 10 attack. Right? Can't do the extra damage shield. Bad upgrades. Early on unit upgrades aren't good. Especially since we got the totem. Enemy units start with 10 armor. That's very spooky. Do we need the unit draft to win this? Maybe we do. I think we can do this this time. We do have some time. Especially like this, for example. We do this. We do this. And then we do like... Burst you down a bit. Hit you with some damage, they all deal basically no damage. Extra energy next floor. If I silence that, that's not good enough. I could do multi-strike here, that's not good enough. We you deal 3 damage, that's fine. I want to kill you, so I guess we do... 5 damage, frost by 10. You take the damage here, I think we do multi-strike. Titan's Tooth. Bye. Oh, he stays up the front line! Oh no! The bastard is actually dazed. You're gonna die, and you're gonna die. Oh, that daze really gets me. Okay, I guess we'll try to sap the enemy. Almost no damage uh, done. You'll die to the sweep. Oh, that's real bad. Oh, that's not good at all. I could even say that's incredibly bad. I mean, I can do this, but it doesn't matter because he spikes. He's down to two. So I guess... I guess we'll instead do one... And you get fed with morsels. We got spell weakness two and an ice tornado. Not quite what I was hoping for. Fifty damage now. Hmm. Well, he's, he's halfway done. Extra frostbite. I think that should ease the damage we deal to him. We're gonna take some damage, but he takes frostbite damage after every round, so we're fine. We survived. That's the big part. And we get a unit draft. That's good. Another offering, eh? Titan's gratitude to trigger the offering we got already. 
deal damage gain damage I like it what's our units a morsel maker I can use that to feed this train steward maybe I like the muscle maker. He's expensive early on, but just having the muscle maker churn in the background and feed someone. We don't need duplicate, I need the heal though. On the other hand, spell upgrade and unit. Spell weakness on a sweep. That's basically. I don't need the encant rage, so we're doing that. I do the caverns first. Let's see what we get. Upgrade a spell to make it cheaper. We're gonna do that for sure. Magic power and consume on a spell. That also seems pretty good. Okay. Show me what you got. Throw something in. Purge a card, gain a card. Wait. The card we throw in is the one we purge or is it the one we gain? Oh, this is it. We purge the card and now we do we get one to Stygian Guard or an Umbra card? I think I want a Stygian Guard card, right? Oh, that's good. That actually helps a lot. We removed the bad card and we got the 90 damage card. We have quite a few spell weakness applier. So if we apply spell weakness to the enemy and then burst to more 180. Now the important part for this to work, we need to beat the boss on 30 HP. That's pretty spooky. That's five. I can play all of these. No ice tornado. I'll basically be like, you gonna tank, and then we're gonna do some spell weakness for sweeps. And I will a uh, damage shield here. Do I want a damage shield? No, I think I want a damage shield there. Or do I want a damage shield here? Let's damage shield her. You're gonna put the bomb up top, that's fine. One, two, three. Oh, it's a 50 50. No, it's even worse. If I put you here, you will die. If I put you up here, you will die because that's a double explosion. No, it's the single explosion. I can't deploy these because there's units here and here the bomb up there. That's a bad. I guess I can deploy the train steward here if I shade splitter to block a unit. Like the idea is this, this, block the bombs explosion, and we discarded the right card. Lucky ass, I guess. We're losing a train steward there. Oh, the damage shield blocked the one damage on death there. Okay, how do we do this? We use this to kill you. So I'm gonna play two of these. Do I want to damage shield? I want to damage shield, right? Yeah, I want to damage shield. And we're gonna frozen lands. Go down to one. Kill you, get to energy back. Use Ice Tornado here to kill you. He's got some major spell weakness now. I kind of want a Shade Splitter on you. And then Primal Dust here. You will keep.
They shouldn't deal damage now. The extinguish, I think, is gone. So your spell damage shields stay intact. We'll do the frozen lance here. Pack these up there, put these down here. That seems right. And then... Oh, I could put some stuff up there. Well, we do get some damage with the multi-striking dude. In comes uh, the final wave. I'm gonna play you for two. We get the energy back. I want the shade spitter for sure. You die up there, that's fine. I want this damage shield here. Now what about you though? And then... Extra energy on my dude over here. The dazed applies... Or do we get the morsels at the beginning of turn? Oh, he was dazed, so he didn't spawn morsels. That's kind of bad. Now I can. No, four. This is frost by ten, and this is extra damage. This is better. It deals a lot of damage because of the spell weakness. We knew it hits twice here. That was guaranteed. And then we frozen lands, we shade switcher. Uh, we block one more attack. And now he's got so much spell weakness, we will just burn him down. Nine spell weakness. Take 900 damage. <laughs> okay. That seems good. We don't need trample. Rage 4, multi strike 1, ember drain 4. We don't need that. I guess I'll take the Kindle. Ooh, this is someone we can fuel with our stuff. That's good. That's good, but we have so many expensive ones, I think we need the extra energy. Of we don't have that, I mean, by now we have enough units, for sure. Healing, artifact, gold, I take it. Healing, gold, artifact. We can't have them use, but if they go through through the pyre room, we attack first. Spell weakness 2 or make damage spells cheaper? I didn't think about that option. Spell weakness 2 is great if we continue with the setup we're doing. But make damage spells cheaper, considering we have like 2, 3, 3 costs. No, let's take this, let's take this one. I mean, this would have also been better sweep attack. With 10, 10 attack instead of 5? That was... I think that was very close. Normally it's this close. This is dangerous. Because that makes the clip defender deal damage. And I don't think we can tank that. We don't have enough defenses to survive that. So you know what? We have to fight like this, I think. I would like to take the gold. But we still have 160 gold from the last 4. So hopefully this is not too bad. Now I'm going to do a 1 and a 2 and a 3. You get encountered. Put the trains to it here. You have to die with this one, I guess, to get the gold. Oh no, with this one. So wait. We'll place you. Here? I have to calculate. Two. I'm gonna use the pyre bound. You do mind collapse, that does the encant. And then you will feed this one afterwards, because these two kill him. 
And they also have enough spell weakness that they should get killed if we draw our spells for once. Actually, it doesn't quite kill you. Wait. They also get free, so it kills them. Now we're gonna do this. Are you dead? Almost kills you. Actually... Do I want to kill you? You can't quite attack yet. Now my dude is ready. Well, they died to Ice Tornado. When we're gonna do packed morsels here. Ice Tornado kills all of these. What about you? We don't have the damage to kill you, sadly. Gonna do this. We do 25, I need one point of damage. Which we could, but he's dazed, so we can't. I guess... Really, one point short, that's so sad. That's 11 points of damage from us. Okay, ah, the encant doesn't matter. Extra energy next turn, I'll take it. I don't know, put some morsels up the top floor. In comes the boss. That's a pretty easy boss. As far as things are considered. We can... Can't quite kill you. Oh, there's this train steward up here. I want that for sure. Can I place this train steward somewhere? No. So I guess we do... That is fine. The first floor is not there to do the damage, This the first floor is there to apply spell weakness. And with the sap totem that's actually kind of working so far. We play all the spells down there, sap them and apply spell weakness, on the second floor they get killed. For example like this. I just love it. Gotta admit, it's just great. More spell weakness, frozen to a card in hand is great. An offering that saps, that's even better. Oh, I like that a lot. Oh, I want the excavated embers for sure. Oh, this that's so good. It it implies uh, it applies and can't draws through a deck, gives us energy. Healing artifacts. We can buy an artifact, or we can reroll and buy an artifact. And this, or do we? Try to upgrade spells again, remove two cards, and get some extra gold. It's not easy. Spell upgrade could be good. Like... There's stuff I don't want to consume, there's stuff I would like... There's nothing really I want to hold over right now. Not really, right? So I guess we'll go left side. The heal is good. Let's go Concealed Caverns first. What the hell is this? Iceberg looms after the bone shake. Illuminated by the light creeping into the cavern, you can read a figure inside, trapped. Roots etched in the eyes, into the eyes read. 
Witness the false prophet, forge of the rail and covenant, now damned and broken. I think we had this at the very beginning. 15 additional magic power, but less capacity on each floor. Plus capacity on each floor, plus 3 on a random floor. I wish we had capacity. If I reduce the capacity on each floor, we can't do the thing we did earlier. With like the Ice Sidophile, Titan Spain. Wait, one, two, three, four, we can do it still. Plus 50 magic power is too strong in our deck. Plus 15! And the Ice Storms hit three times. It's 45 damage. Okay, show me what you got. The first friendly unit gets damage shield is good. Spells gain an extra upgrade slot is actually really good. That would be great. If we ever get to do spell upgrades. I think I want... Damage shield on the first friendly summoned unit. Keep a friend a random card I didn't play in my hand is also really good by the way. So the question is, do I want the spell upgrade or the chain or do we reroll and hope for something even better? The damage shield can be good. It's only the first friendly unit somebody shot now. That is a few damage shields. The spell upgrades is great. The idea is basically the dream is cheaper cheaper holdout. Imagine that. One cost ice tornado every turn and it also already deals so much damage. That would be great. But okay let's reroll. I want to see something else. And at the start of your turn common morsel. Morsel units have damage shield. Never play your third spell of the turn. All cards gain plus one magic power for the rest of the battle. I'll take this. And then we'll remove a train steward. Okay, not the best. Let's see if we could have gotten a spell upgrade next turn. They appear on each floor and we get extra gold. Again, the top floor dazes, but we can let him through the top floor. The vapor th funnel, I think that's good. I think the units that apply on each floor are just... Uh, the rage dudes, right? And if they do, vapor funnel just kills them. Yeah, we're completely fine. Now the trouble here is... I can't play this down here. If I play these two, he gets they get zapped. Two damage on him and he loses both both damage shields, right? Because of the sweep. Could put this here, but it dies to the sweep. Can't do Ice Empire. It doesn't matter. The fact that the guy sweeps is actually really annoying. Okay, I'm gonna do this first. Do the second. He's still doing two damage, so we do primal dust next. So you don't die, but first. You'll take six damage. I can put you down here, right? Yeah, easily. And then we do this. Five damage shields. Yeah, we lost the dude, that's fine. Vapor funnel actually carrying us right there. What do we have? Morsel maker over here. I want that. But then I also have to kill you. Now you will just be killed like this or like this. Don't even have to use the consume one. If I do that. 
I still have two spells for you. No, I don't. So you take the damage. I'm gonna do Morsel Maker here for sure. I guess we'll kill you. Right now you deal four damage to each. That hurts. Now you deal two damage to each. No, I think we... No, I think we kill you. Four damage to each doesn't kill us. We have a spell weakness. So we... No, I think we do this, right? We do Titan's Gratitude, hope to discard one of these. If we discard this one, we're screwed. And then I can do Ice Tornado up here. To kill them. We discarded the wrong one! I guess it's fine. It's it's not horribly wrong. It's just very annoying. One of the other ones would have been better. Okay. I guess doesn't matter much. Kill you. Put you up here. He's being fueled. In comes the boss. an enemy unit, eh? So we do that. That... No, he still has stealth. How unfortunate. The sap? So really getting there, eh? The stealth is too long. Yeah, she just clears everything out. Oh, I like damage shields here. I also like sap 3, right? No, the damage shields I think is just better. We do this over here, and then damage shield you a lot. That deals a lot of damage. It's not ideal. Actually, I think I should have used all the damage shields now that I think about it. It's fine. Turns out, it is actually fine. That wasn't easy. Stealth at the bottom line, so our spells deal normal damage. That's just not fair. Discard your hand, apply destiny units. That's an enabler for my offering spells. Now that we don't want to do. That we don't want to do. I think we're skipping this actually. None of these were, was great. We have a lot of gold. There would have been no spell upgrades. I mean, there is no spell upgrades. Do I want units upgrades or do I want duplicate? Duplicate on... I mean, the Ice Tornado is pretty good. The Offerings. I'm gonna try the unit upgrades, I think. I mean, we can heal. We can go to the Caverns. Ah, it's this again. Magic power and purge? I mean, imagine that. But no. I think I'd rather do this. Make a really powerful train steward we can get rid of. That helps us in the boss fight, right? Uh, 
and then Merchant of Steel quick damage shield you get four damage shields now you know what I think this is better do we want her to be quick so she attacks first that seems good you take the damage shield I guess Oh no, I can't buy this. You take damage shield 4. Okay, I mean that's all the money gone. Not great. Pretty happy I didn't take the spell upgrade stuff. I would have loved if that said we just had add a spell instead of a unit upgrade. Spell shield 5. Oh, why? Why would you do this to me? I guess we can still go through that. It's just these units, not all of them. That actually is good enough to kill them. Uh, put you in here. Put them. No, if I put the muscle maker now, we're screwed. I guess we do this. They all die. Oh, this one gains extra damage. No! No damage on you, eh? I didn't pay attention. I can... Zap... One, two, I guess I would like the alloy construct to be honest. But I think the only way we can survive this is if I play Lodestone up front. Shade Spitter. We kill you with that, so I do the offering first. Yeah, I think that actually works. No! I can't kill you with that now. I wanted to do the mind collapse. I guess I should have. But if a mind collapsed, we couldn't have played the offering. The idea was mind collapse, the backline, I get two energy back, play the construct. That didn't work out. But we don't take any damage. Do I want Ice Tornado? Could hit these two, that would be bad. I could just do like Zap to zap them down. Do Ice Tornado here? No, wait, I can't do Ice Tornado there. Well, that's still good. This one will get through. Oh, he gets incant. Oh, that's so bad. Why do the stupid statues have spell resistance? You have spell resistance again. I mean, we can, we can do some incants here. Sixty-five, uh, down to fifty something. We do twenty-five, so it doesn't matter. For a second, have you gain ten armor to reduce that? No, to apply the damage shield. You will lose your two damage shields. But I will apply the damage. Oh, he's dazed. Bastard. So we will take uh, 10 damage. I can live with that. There's the 10 damage. He's not sweeping, right? He's the harvester. I mean, 
start with this, eh? Add some morsels. Apply days to enemy units. I can apply days here, right? You don't have spell weakness applied yet. Apply days discard. I think I want the damage instead of the dazed. So I do this this down here, and then there's morsel for somewhere, I guess for you. Attack. I would like the attack in lifesteal. Yeah, I think that's better. I can put this morsel somewhere. We'll do this to sap. Okay. I was hoping it discards the morsel so we can play the other spell. Hey, whatever. Die. Don't want to draw morsels. We're taking another 10, maybe 15 if we're unlucky. I think we are unlucky. Yeah. Actually, you know, 15. We're drawing the wrong cards. We're gonna take so much more here. It's insane. I can't damage them because the statue is just in the way. I could do this. He's, he's got to get dazed. <laughs> oh no. I mean, I'm He's dazed. This doesn't damage the statue. So we take... I think we're dead. 12, 12, 12. And they're at 90. So we need 4 hits, we take 3. 12 times 3, we're not dead. We only take 36. But yeah, I'm drawing everything in the wrong order. I'm pretty happy with the funnel. Without the funnel, we would have been dead by now. The spell shields. It's incredible. How much we're suffering from that. Like, I can't even do this. Now it dies, at least. But we take in another... 18 damage here, and another... F 6 there. We're getting very close to actually being dead. But not quite there yet. Now that would be nice, if it weren't for the fact that we are still pretty screwed, because I haven't dealt any damage to the boss. Oh, I have dealt a bit of damage. Oh, I only take the 8 times 3? Oh, he had even more damage. Okay. We're playing this. You take multiple damages, right? You're actually still here. I can't play both of these. Because I played the morsel there. Do I want to do damage here or do I wait a turn? If I wait a turn, they're going to move up here where they can't do anything. So you'll get fueled by one. That is a sad, I don't know what is. Oh no, never mind. He only needs one slot. We're fine. He gets fueled a bit more. It's still not great. I think she gets a lot of spell damage. The idea is one hit her with spell damage on the third floor. 15 spell weakness. It's a good setup. 
Now, the problem is you. I think I just want... I can... That doesn't do much. Front enemy unit discard. Now, I think I want the day's discard hand trigger the offering. If the if we're unlucky, the ice storm hits this one like twice, this one once. I think I prefer it like this, where we have this turn to draw a big damage spell. Wait. No, it's the best one, and it should kill. Yeah, we did it. Ooh, spooky. I'll take that. Make the floor bigger. This is not good at all. We're really lucky to have survived there. There's spell upgrades. And there's the healing. I want healing, but I also want spell upgrades. We do have 170 something. The artifact could help us with upgrades. I think we need the health. This one, we can't buy anything here though. That's that's dead. So caverns and health? No, this one is better for sure. Because this is basically caverns in a bit worse. When you ever play a third card, draw two. Cards with consumer have a chance to be discarded. We have a few consume cards. Where you play extra card draw is also really nice. But let's take the... Ooh, extra card draw though. The idea is... Maybe we get the upgrade on him where the spells get cheaper and then we can just put spells on the bottom and draw more spells. The consume is good because of this. There's a few different chance to keep the excavated ember in my deck. That's real good. I mean, that's fine. This is, I mean, this is always okay. I think the boss is the sap one, right? Yeah. Let's take the winged steel. Okay. Upgrade the spell to be cheaper. I think that's a good upgrade, cheaper. Magic power and consume. Remove consume. Make it cost one. I mean, on this, this is basically good. And on this, add more excavated ember. Excavated ember is always good. Okay, I'll take this. Now we can't really get hold over anymore. We got hold over here. That would have been better. Because I could have folded, hold over one of the ice tornadoes, right? I guess make the ice tornado. I can make you cheap again. No, make one of the ice tornadoes cost one. If we had more gold. Of course, we're upgrading you. That's bad. I don't have the make a spell cheaper. <laughs> I had it the other two times. I didn't take it, and now I was like, yeah, would have been real good now. But we get something else. Do I want frostbite or do I want spell weakness? An additional stack of spell weakness or some 10 frostbite. Take the 10 frostbite. Increases the attack by more. Oh, we're just like getting by so close. No, I don't want. No, 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 no. We, we would die versus the spikes. For sure. My sweep units will just kill themselves. This is already pretty hard. Do you lose multi-strike if I do that? I mean, this is not good. They get silenced. I think... Disabled triggered abilities. Never mind, they don't lose their multi-strike. I can... Sap 2, that's minus 4. So that's a damage shield, damage shield. 
Uh, get hit for 8, 16, 24. Which means the lodestone survives and we kill them. Oh, we draw extra cards. Oh, that's perfect. That's exactly what I want to see. Easy. We drew the quick sweep. It clears out all the multi-striking annoying dudes. Start with this for sure. I think we put this one up top, right? That delays the morsel making by one, because they will get dazed. I have eight, I can play all of these. So I'm gonna offering you to kill you. Do I want to offering here? No, I think this is fine. I mean, put them up top for sure. Discard a cat random card. So we can shade splitter here. Some extra energy and then we'll do this and clear both to get the extra magic power and the Ekatra was really good doing it still. That was amazing. It saved two of our turns so far. If I want this as my third spell. I can't though, unless I play this first, which is a bit unfortunate. I can zap you. I think this is... I mean, this doesn't actually make a difference. I could just kill the front line now. That, that's, a, that's a waste of time. I play Train Steward, this, discard, draw. And then we don't have any energy. So I think I just play the Primal Dust, right? Maximum damage deflection. If I play the Sap, it's basically two damage deflection on this one. I can do this to draw two cards and get... That's insane. Now we have energy back. That's actually amazing. I didn't think that they uh, they still do 15 the X spells. Do I want the train steward in the middle? Apply dazed somewhere. Extra sap. I'm so happy about the quick sweep, by the way. That's the big carry boys. I don't have to do the... I do have to do the consume. It's one. Two. Three. Play this. Extra energy. We got even more spell power up. Get some morsels. Get some ice tornadoing. You take a damage shield, excavate, chain split up. Big damage shields here, right? 
this one. Two energy back. Can't do morsels up here, so we're doing them down here. And I've played three spells already, so I don't have to play this. I will though, because I can. We got this fully under control. An extra draw. I don't want you to attack. Actually, I can just kill you this and you with this, right? Extra energy next turn, sure. I want him fueled up, that's why I, I don't want to kill the guys before they attack. Okay, let's see what we can do. Don't want to hit him. Right, we get extra stuff. He gets plus one attack, but an additional sap, which is fine, right? Oh, look at the spell weakness. And the frozen. Oh, the fr frozen is really bad against this boss, by the way. Like, incredibly bad. If you weren't sapped and we didn't have that many damage shields, we would be completely screwed. He just gets plus one attack every turn from just the uh, frostbite. The thing is, he's already basically dead, and now I do this. 1300 times 3. And I still have the fueled machine up top. Apply frostbite to enemy units. Yeah, I want that. Plus 1 per turn for the rest of the battle. And minus one capacity on the floor. We'll take it. As we saw, we have a bottom floor, a top floor, and the middle floor is kind of eh. I mean, the upgrade is kind of nice. Duplicate and removal. Do we have cards to remove? Honestly, I mean, Shadespit is actually kind of good. Because it's two spells. We can remove that one train steward. One of the frozen lances. Get spell upgrades. There's still the chance for holdover on that one. Or do we go here to he I think we do on here. Check the artifacts first. Can't buy anything. We don't want anything here either way. Okay, so we remove the bad train steward. I don't want to remove these because there's two spells for the uh, draw when you play three. It's this one and then the morsel. So I guess we take one of these. No holdover, eh? <laughs> remove consume. I'll make him more expensive and then make him cheaper again. It costs me all my money, but I can make it basically remove consume from a spell. No. Give me holdover. That's permafrost. That's not holdover, but I can keep a card in my hand until I need to play it. I would also keep that with Ice Tornado, right? How much does it cost? 100, exactly. Do I prefer magic power and weakness over permafrost? Like, permafrost could work well on days. 
just do this and if if there's the chance of a unit somewhere of mine somewhere dying we just do permafrost the frenzy swarm i mean play the play this do the dazed that's good but i also like this cheaper and then plus damage on something maybe this to get the energy that would be good I'm taking the... I think this is the safe route. And then we can duplicate something. I forgot about that. It will be the ice tornado. Right? Don't want the spells? Yeah, it will be the ice tornado. And away we go. This is a great spell slinging day. The sap is completely fine. Actually... It's not great. I want my sweep units to actually attack. So we're gonna do a one and a two and a three. I can't play these two again. You're kidding me. Discard a card at random. He will take a lot of damage. But I guess that's all we can do. I can play these two to get spell damage up. And then both of these will be shuffled in. I think I should still have the construct at the top floor. I can prevent 10 damage. If I played, this, if I played these two, we could have reduced the damage, by the way. Not by a lot, because most of this is the damage shield. Could have prevented the damage by eight. Played these two. Actually, he had spell weakness, right? So, 82, 120. Okay, this one never worked out. Against harvest on this, yeah. Yeah, this is pretty sad. Not the start I want to see. That's for sure. Give me the... Thank you. I was hoping for that. Because she clears out all the bad guys. This one is still annoying, honestly. Which means I probably still do this. Damn it. Actually... That applies basically all the sap. And we frostbite you, and we frozen lance you. No, frozen lance is not good enough. Which means I can frozen lance you. Draw extra cards. Oh, the ice tornado. But we can frostbite you. Oh, the attack. The unit uses fuel every turn either way. Not on attack, but on turn. I didn't know that. Let's see. Damage shield is nice. We're drawing some extra cards. Okay. You are scary. And I don't actually... I didn't draw any damage. And you don't have fuel. So you will just kill me. If I'm seeing this correctly. I can make you daze. That doesn't work. This is triggered. That doesn't help. These enemies I play in here will be dazed. So you will... I guess the frostbite might help out. He can only take three times though. You deal you take fourteen. Go in there. The first attack will be ten damage. We do need to do some damage up here, and I don't think we can. I already had the extra draw. I think we might be dead if I didn't miscalculate. Chances are pretty good, we're completely screwed. Plus 
by them a shield. No. I mean, that doesn't work. The triggered ability is denied. That's actually pretty huge. We're gonna do this. Play you in here. Morsel for the block. Okay, let's hope I'm not dead. I might be. For real. The funnel, without the funnel I would be dead for sure. I think I still might be, is the thing. Oh no. He didn't get the 25 armor. Uh, the 15 armor of the harvest. I guess the top floor doesn't count as a floor anymore. Okay, how do we do this? We gotta kill you, for sure. You're fueled, I need a bit additional damage. You will just get the kill. Even on zero mana. I would like the Ice Tornado here. Yeah, I do. I killed you. We need to kill you on zero mana. That's good enough. So I'm gonna daze you. No, that discards everything. Which means we will do... I mean, that also applies Frostbite on everything, right? There's frostbite, but then we can't kill you. Wait, 50? That's fine. Because of the dazed, you actually don't deal any damage. Which means this is kind of fun, right? What are we gonna draw next turn? We have ice tornado. We're fine. We're actually drawing him right now means I can't kill you. You gain energy back. Ice tornado you or kill you? Ah, let's make sure there's nothing coming f through. Right. Stupid sap. And we're gonna start with this. Gonna do this. Split uh, uh, this one. Ice tornado. We're gonna block this. More sap. Kill you. Or deal damage here. Could have should have put the muscle up top to fuel the fuel the machine. This has to be put here. Kill you with Pyrebound. These will take some damage. Do sap here so we don't take damage at the bottom side. Alright, we draw extra cards. Additional fuel. I mean, this is still the right move, I think. Does he actually have fuel? I think he does. Can I see? Yeah, fuel one. Okay. One additional turn of damage? No, you're, you're all sapped. Do I want to damage you? Put this on you? Sure, why not? Kill you. Let's see, excavated ember is nice. That's nice. 
Continue fueling you. That's a kill here. It also consumes, but that's fine. Wait, we can't just do this, right? And then you down here. That kills you, so we gain energy back. Which means we do this. We do this. I don't want to discard the Frenzied Swarm, right? I will discard the Frenzied Swarm. Well, I think we've won. It's gonna stack some of that stuff. One, two... Right, can't do this. Three, we draw an extra cards. More sap here. We'll feed you this. You get dazed and then both offerings will trigger. I will do 1000 damage with these little damage. I guess the frostbite will do most of the damage, but there's still gonna be lots of spell weakness and that is good enough. Okay. There's, this is the feeling of a control deck. You're at 19 spell weakness? You're still sapped? How long are you sapped? You're at 28 spell weakness, my friend? That doesn't sound very healthy. I mean, look what I can do. 1300 times 4, uh, times 3. The first one is enough to kill you. Great. That was a lot of fun. <laughs> Hit him with the big spell damages. Got him good. Oh, wind streak of two. Yeah. It was really close. Devil is in the details. I guess we we're just very good. Merchant rerolls cost twenty percent more. That's unfortunate. That was a really good one with the quick plus attack. Great, and we get unlocks. Gifts for a guard. Draw three spells and enhance them with Consume, Magic, Power, plus 20 and 0. That's really good. The secondary only gain half HP or uh, half experience or something? Apparently Stygian is my best one. We, we beat it at 8 and 10. One, two, three, and seven. Like secondary and primary. It's pretty good. And we're at Covenant rank 11. Oh, there's. Oh, above 10, there's a different win streak. Imp Cup streak. We got a streak of two. Maybe we can. If we win the next one, we at least are even here. Yeah? I like it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video because I did. I'm just seeing it's really long already. So. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next episode.